Tonight, 18 year old Darian Johnson is charged with second degree murder, but he's still not in police custody. Good evening. I'm Mike Bush. And I'm Kelly Jackson. Five on your sides. Brent Solomon is live in Clayton with the clue that investigators say put the teen at the scene of the crime. Well, Kelly, police say that 18 year old was seen driving a white Chrysler 300 to his job last month. The very next day, they say he used that same car with other suspects to break into other cars in Clayton, ultimately killing a man when he tried to stop them. Take a look at this photo. Police say if you see 18-year-old Darion Johnson of St. Louis, call 911. They say he and 18-year-old Turnell Johnson broke into cars on Wydown Boulevard and South Hanley Road in Clayton last month and then shot and killed 41-year-old Joshua Harris when he approached them. Tuesday, police said shots were fired from both sides of a white Chrysler 300. Right now, Turnell is in custody. Darion is on the run. Do you think they thought we're going to kill someone? No. When people are you know, together, there are mechanisms of self, what they feel to be self-protection, even if you know, they're not doing something right. It becomes, it's, you know, them or me. Kenya Brumfield Young is a criminal justice professor at St. Louis University. She's worked with incarcerated youth. I've heard everything from, you know, I did this to help my parents or help my family or, you know, I've got siblings at home or there's absent parents or, um, you know, I connected with my friends and those are the people that, you know, gave me you know, made me feel wanted. Professor Brumfield Young has worked at detention centers throughout her career. I asked, in her experience, is threat of jail time a deterrent for young people who would commit crimes? Those who are new fear the experience. I think it's like anything else. Once they understand, there's no longer fear of the unknown. With some of these young people, there is that they're getting, you know, a roof over their head. They're getting fed. That may be a situation that's not occurring at home. There's structure. She says it's time for leaders across the St. Louis metro to unite and intervene. We are a region. We're not just a pocket. So we, you know, th those occurrences are expanding with good programming that young people tend to recidivate less. And Johnson is wanted tonight on two felony charges, armed criminal action and second degree murder. If you know where he is, call police at 314-290-8425. Live in Clayton, Brent Solomon, five on your side.